up to now, the U.S. is still the only country in the world that owns a stealth bomber. They currently have 21 B-2 Spirits in service. Recently, the U.S. also said that it has completed the first B-21 Rider style strategic bomber prototype. Ground testing phase at Air Force Plant 42 at Palmdale, California. The B-21 Rider style bomber will be tested for the launch system, structural integrity, and painted. U.S. Air Force officer Darlene Castello revealed on March 4. The first B-21 prototype will undergo engine testing, getting ready for its maiden flight from Air Force Plant 42 to Edwards Air Force Base in California. Mr. Costello said, Northrop Grumman Corporation currently has six B-21 stealth bombers at different stages of production. We are on track for our first flight and are staying on schedule, Costello said, without detailing the test plan. U.S. Air Force Secretary Frank Kendall on March 4 also expressed satisfaction with the progress of the B-21 stealth bomber project. At least at this stage, the B-21 project is progressing really well, Kendall said. Northrop's Aeronautics Systems President Tom Jones confirmed that the first B-21 stealth bomber is undergoing ground tests. Mr. Jones said Northup Corporation did a lot of work in the lab to minimize the risk and ensure there were no surprises during the test. The U.S. Air Force has been tight-lipped for months about its plans to test the B-21 a fifth-generation style bomber with a tailless flying wing design. Similar to the B-2 Spirit style bomber was born 21 years ago. The B-21 project has a development cost of about $23.5 billion, of which the production cost of each aircraft is about $656 million. The first aircraft could enter service in 2025 and will gradually replace the B-2s and part of the B-1B Lancer fleet. The information comes in the context of many concerns that the B-21 project is behind schedule, seriously affecting the U.S. Air Force plan to deploy 225 bombers of which the main force is there the B-52 and B-21 squadrons. The U.S. Air Force has a total of 21 B-2 Spirits, 45 B-1B Lancers, and 76 B-52s, but many of them are not in a ready state. The Air Force proposed a budget of nearly $2.9 billion for the B-21 program in fiscal year 2022, up $30 million from a year earlier. The B-21 Rider is a fifth-generation stealth bomber possessing the same flying wing design as the B-2 Spirit born in 1989. The U.S. Air Force has not developed the features of the B-21 series, but it is expected to integrate advanced star technology, carry many weapons, and be highly automated. Star ability and modern weapons make B-21 known as America's new generation of star assassins. The Pentagon plans to buy 100 B-21 bombers. Ronto Martin, 
the cost of the B-21 is only one-third of the B-2 Spirit. <laughs>